we have a new element called feeder block. You can install this feeder block when creating a new schematic or you can add it later on. Here you can choose create feeder block when you are creating a schematic and afterwards you can edit feeder block. When editing the feeder block, the data is stored into the DVG. The same way you pick properties to low circuits, the same way you are allowed to pick properties in the feeder circuits. After you have selected the properties you want to include into the feeder circuit, the next step is to update the feeder circuit to match the values, for example in this case, from plan drawing. Values from the plan drawing are received or imported from the circuit itself. 